interview take two okay my next question is um, actually a question that uh, Don Ray would want to ask you and I'm gonna ask it for him which is would you compare him to any artist that is living right now and any artist that from the past that is deceased would you compare his work with no, the only the only guy that relates to him in a very funny way, Don Ray is 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 a piece of Americana. It has to be understood. Uh, there's so many people who claim that, uh, but there's nowhere near his involvement with, like the rodeo. Uh, uh, the, the Western scenes. He, he, he's a native of Texas, I believe. Right. And uh, so, so he has his his thing. He's he's an immense scholar. He's an amazing guy. For example, his his history of the Bible he knows by heart. Oh, he is a Christian. Uh, incre incredible, incredible. Uh, I mean, he quote this and that from this psalm or that psalm or, the, or this paragraph or that. Uh, quote the person who's saying it. So he ha he has embedded that, and he's and he's uh, he's aspired, and he sees art. He goes to museums and looks at stuff, and and uh, in an exchange that we we have, we both mutually talk about art. And we have long talks on the phone about this painting or that painting should be seen as et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So. Um, now, what was your question again? How would you... It's a tough question. How would you compare him to any... His work to any no, past would, or present living artist? I wouldn't or? compare him. I, I, the only person, in a sense, is a flavor. And I compared him to Johnny Cash, in a sense. But Cash is one kind of thing, and, and Don Ray is an artist. Of course. Yeah. Uh, but that, that kind of Americana, there's something that happens... Uh, in spite of the surround, and and suddenly out of J Johnny Cash will come something that relates in a very deep sense. And the same thing with Don in his paintings, with his with his with his marvelous metaphors. Yes, his uh, visual prayers, as Don Ray likes to call them, which uh, reflect the struggles of everyday life, basically. Now, I, I just have. Uh, one more question for you. You have called him, of course, the Johnny Cash of American uh, art. What is there a connection, if there is a connection between Johnny Cash and a artist, a painter like Don Ray, what, I mean, it's hard to answer, I, I gotta admit, it's, this is a, but if there uh, is a connection, Don Ray is always asked, you see a connection with the Americana, anything? I, I would say because of, of, of the uh, the living energy and the land and the people that, you know, surmise in song is surmised in painting. So I guess... Well, the things that almost go unnoticed in Johnny Cash, he'll hit on something that is total truth, right? And it, and it has a resonance of a kind. And Don Ray's uh, presence in, in the work does that, I mean, to in an artist, artistic sense, and completely. I mean, his drawings, and again, the metaphor is very important. He, it is. He has an intuitive sense of metaphor that is unparalleled. Well... Uh, I just want to say one more question in our series of conversations we've had with uh, Don Ray over the uh, with Knox over Don Ray through the years. I have one final question, and that is, um, I've been studying a lot of the Dutch artists because you have I've attended your lectures at the League, and I've seen your insights and your you like some of the Dutch painters. Just for for this for this archive that we're doing in this documentary. What is a brief, again, assessment of the Dutch masters? What is the... Uh, a brief assessment of the Dutch well, masters. Well, I mean, you just say one word, Rembrandt. Rembrandt. Right? 
alongside of Leonardo da Vinci, the two most popular artists in the world, and that whole school, Franz Hals, one of the great, great painters, and uh, the people that came out of, his, out of his studio who studied with him. One of them is the greatest woman painter. Her name is um, Second one. You can pause, pause, hit pause.